I'm Victoria Thornton and I'm founding director of Open House, which is about just opening buildings to explore the architecture in our city. Margaret, you've done it before. You've, everyone says they've done open house. It's quite interesting. Oh, I'm a great fan. It opened my eyes to architecture. Uh, and this year, I think your theme is the changing face of London. So we thought we'd have a walk around this area just south of the Olympic Park. This is one of the um, oldest mills, isn't it? Yes, yeah, it is. And it's fantastic how they've managed to preserve it. You just can't believe, really, in the centre of London, that you come across something like this. Looking over the Olympic Park, it's fantastic to see the stadium there, the aquatic centre. They will take the edges away and it'd be left for the community at the end. So this is um, Dane's Yard, where Ikea are going to yeah. Houses, offices. A brave development to get right and that everybody feels ownership of it as well. It's no good yes. if it's, it feels dead at night or no one's really attracted by it. There's only a few structures here that uh, would have been here at the beginning of the century, but this one, the pumping mill, is uh, Abbey Mills, is quite extraordinary. People were horrified by this, but probably when it was first built, because it wasn't of what they normally expected um, in their own generation. So I think it's uh, when I always have to remember that things were always contemporary in their own time. These gasometers are quite extraordinary. They're real sculpture piece, aren't they? They are. Well, I think it's really important to keep spaces like this in an area that's under such sort of development. A nice way to spend a few hours with you, Margaret, <laughs> just wandering and talking about architecture and what has happened in the past and, as you say, what's happening in the future around here. And then maybe we come back in about 10 years' time and have the same conversation and see what's happened. <laughs>